Good evening, I'm Jill Valley. And I'm Dennis Bragg. A 17-year-old Big Sky High School student is being held on multiple charges stemming from Friday's shooting incident in the school's parking lot. Today, that student appeared in court. MTN's Augusta McDonald was at the hearing and brings us more on this developing case. Augusta. Thanks, Jill. Dennis, if you see something, say something. That phrase has been repeated to students in Missoula County Public Schools for weeks, and that's what happened on Friday when students brought forward their concerns about a classmate. The student was on parole, and the reports sparked an investigation that was being wrapped up on Friday when the suspect fled the school. The Montana Department of Justice's Division of Criminal Investigation, who is investigating this incident, reports that the school resource officer shot at the vehicle when the student attempted to run the SRO over with his car. Friday, uh, the probation office was doing a probation search at the school, um, inquiring about the possibility of having a firearm. Um, he left the school, got into his vehicle, uh, rapidly left. A handgun suspected in the incident was found by a citizen along South Avenue where the suspect fled from officers. Uh, we are confident there was not a weapon inside the school building. We know that. And uh, it was as the situation migrated to the parking lot that things escalated. The suspect then crashed his vehicle into the Honda dealership on South Reserve where he was arrested. The male has not yet been charged but is being held on a parole violation and multiple charges including two felonies. Prosecutors say they have not decided if he will be charged as an adult because they do not yet know what they will be able to charge him with pending the ongoing investigation. Some Big Sky High School parents have expressed concerns about communication from the school during the incident. There had been some questions about whether or not the school should have gone into a lockdown. Um, as the situation developed, it immediately left the school site and uh, quite honestly, uh, it took a little bit of time before the school actually knew what transpired uh, in the parking lot. So uh, in the time that it took for uh, the incident to play out, uh, it was resolved and we obviously need to evaluate communication protocols. There will be forums this week at Big Sky High School for students to discuss what happened. Back to you. All right, Augusta, thank you. Bail for this suspect has been set at $20,000. He is expected to make another appearance in district court tomorrow.